Hey guys, so I thought I would do a vlog week in my life thing. I'm actually going back in person for school. This is the first time where I'll be going back. Actually in March, I could have chosen to go back in person, but I didn't go just because at that time I didn't have a vaccine for COVID. So I was like, you know what, let me just hold out. I finally have my vaccine. I have the first dose. We thought it would be good to just meet my teachers in person, especially since the school year is almost gone. It's actually going to be exactly like a month from when I end school. Like I go back May 11th. I end June 11th, which is really crazy. I need to do a lot of things. I forgot what the back to school process is. I need to go dig out my backpack. I need to like charge my computer. I need to update it probably. I also have to get my lunch ready and oh and my outfits. Oh my god I have to plan outfits. I have to look good because for the past I guess since school started I've been virtual and you don't have to show your face so I never show my face. I don't get ready so I'm like just like in my morning face so I'm gonna have to start getting ready. I will update you guys soon. Also the last time I vlogged, this room was completely empty and now it has furniture in it. So just a little room tour. We actually painted all of these walls. They were originally like this like band-aid color. We hung like a collage of paintings from my mom's hometown. If you know where that is, shout out to you. And then these two chairs, this one is from TJ Maxx and then that one's from Home Goods. And they're really comfortable. I never really sit over there just because they're kind of just like there for decoration. Those two chairs are going upstairs. We just haven't taken them up yet. Poofs are from TJ Maxx. The rug is from Home Sense. And then we get to like the main focal point, which is the couch. And I love this thing. It's a recliner. So you press these buttons and the chair folds out. And then if you want to push it back in, you just push that button and then you can like charge your phone. And then the end tables are from TJ Maxx. Hey guys, so it's been a little while since I last vlogged. It is 9.30. Basically what I'm going to start doing is I'm starting to get ready to go back to school. I have to do laundry for the week. I need to go get my backpack from my closet. I haven't used it in over a year. Here is my backpack. I haven't used this baby in a long time. What is in here? There's like silverware in there. But this is my backpack. It's like a dark gray with blue accents and it's North Face backpack. They're really useful, especially for college. Obviously high school too. I have no idea what this one's called, but there's like a back pocket for your computer. And then you have like this sturdy handle thing, and then you have the main pocket, which I don't know, you can put like whatever books, binders, notebooks. I have to fit my lunch in there somehow too, so we'll figure that out. And then like, I think last year I put it in my wallet and then like just other like maybe gum I think I put in here and then in this pocket I had my airpods and then this one I had junk basically in there and then I had like my water bottle all in all it's really big backpack that's really heavy because I don't know if you know but there's like a metal sheet of paper in here to make this part not bend so your computer won't get damaged which is super thoughtful but it adds so much weight to your backpack Hi guys, I think it is 11 o'clock. I am super tired, so I'm gonna get to bed.
about 9.15. I kind of got ready a little bit, not really. I straightened my hair. This is the time where I do homework, and since I have a lot, I'm going to start on it now. I woke up at 8. 30 which is really unlike me seeing as I usually get up at like 9 or 10 but I have a lot to do today I really need to get a head start so guys it is now 11 22 i've been working for two hours straight and i'm about to take a break i am being very productive got my spanish questions done this is the last year i have to take spanish which is really nice because then i have more electives for next year and then i'm doing this gourmet foods project i'm gonna turn in my project soon because i'm almost done with it i need to practice my spanish questions because i actually have a test on that and i suck at speaking spanish literally i can write it i can read it i just can't pronounce some of the words and that's what really gets me so i need to practice okay so i'm warming up my steak and cheese sub and then i'm also gonna do the dishes i'm also making chocolate milk which i'm super excited about because i haven't had milk or chocolate milk in a long time i'm super hungry i did not have breakfast hello guys it is now 3:25. wow this lighting sucks okay this is my outfit my shoes are from nike they're I think the revolution five and they're really new so that's why they're really white i doubt they'll stay white for long and then my pants are from lululemon they're the fast and free but they have a pocket on the side which is really useful and then my sweatshirts from alabama i got it in tuscaloosa and then my necklaces my first one that's right here is from kendra scott it's from a friend and then i have this pearl necklace that i got from lulu's which i got it for christmas i have my watch which is really useful and then i have my purse which is from altered state just looking for fun and then we'll be out of here okay so i just got done shopping i got a new rug for my room it's really soft i'm gonna put it up tomorrow so i can sell my other one and there's like a community yard sale that we're doing in our neighborhood this weekends can we just appreciate how much natural light is coming into my room this is the rug i'm also replacing with the new rug it pills a lot right there and it's so annoying to clean up because i always i'm always vacuuming in here if this does not scream white girl i don't know what does i already showed you my outfit when we left i got starbucks i got a venti strawberry acai they're really good the obsession with alabama starts here no i'm just kidding literally starting to get real i just packed some of the things that i'm gonna bring tomorrow just so i don't have to scramble for everything this has my spanish stuff in it i'm using my binder from last year i am too lazy to switch everything over so half of the stuff is literally from last year's spanish and then this is a like five subject notebook i'm on a walk it's it's kind of desolate out here really nice it's cooled down look at how pretty the sky is here's what it looks like really pretty all right guys i just got done with my walk i'm just kind of laying out the things that i'm gonna bring tomorrow i have no idea what i'm gonna wear tomorrow I have to bring some extra masks. This is what I have so far. So I have my extra mask. This one is the one I'm wearing tomorrow just because I feel like black goes with anything depending on what I wear because I don't know what I'm wearing yet. And then I have this cute hand sanitizer from Bath and Body Works. I also have this spearmint gum. This is my favorite brand. Technically, you're not really supposed to have a snack or like any food. That's why I have gum just to like hold me over till lunch. I have my wallet just in case me and my friends go anywhere. I have my keys attached. I'm not driving or anything. I should probably take these off. I just always have them on here. It's not even a flex or anything. I've always had them because they have my tile keychain. I'm so tired and I still need to unmake the bed. Hey guys, it is 
3.25 and I just got back from the first day of in-person learning and I expected it but like I also didn't expect what the day would look like. Personally, I think virtual learning's better until everybody goes back to school. I am getting ready to put the new rug in my room. We took the old one out. Hello guys and welcome back. It has been a stressful, busy day. Ever since school started, I've been literally so busy. It's already 10, like 45, I think. I should probably be going to bed soon, but I had to make my bed and like I washed all the sheets and I put new sheets on. And my mom, I guess I should say, got the new carpet on and it's so soft. This is what it looks like. Okay, don't mind this box. Good morning. I am making a list. I didn't vlog a lot last night or that day. I have a little list to do today and I haven't got ready yet. I'm having some cereal for breakfast. Making a list because we're, we're running out of food. 7.33, I'm kind of running a little late, but I'm gonna make the bed, get ready. I don't have to straighten my hair because I didn't wash it last night. I think I'm gonna put in dry shampoo. It doesn't really smell bad and it's not that greasy. So it is 3.15. I just got home from school. I'm gonna show you guys my outfit, but I have to do so much homework. I have four, like less than four weeks of school left. So I'm just counting down the days. Anyways, I'm gonna show you my outfit. This is my outfit. It's from, this is from Free People. It's really lightweight and kind of see-through. So I put a um, tank top from Forever 21 underneath of it. And then I have my Lululemon. These are the olive pants. I thought I would mention that because people are gonna be like, oh my God, she's wearing the same exact pants. No, these are the olive green. And then my necklaces again are from Kendra Scott, Lulu's. Pearls, studs, my ring is from, this ring on my ring finger is from Amazon. And this one on my middle finger is from Kohl's. That's my OOTD. I'm gonna go downstairs. I have a huge headache, so yay for that. I also messed up on my eyeliner twice today. Uh, usually I'm pretty good with that. I don't know why I messed up. But... So today I was driving to the grocery store and we have like a grocery store and like a gas station. And me and my dad did not believe how much traffic and the crazy line that was at the gas station just to get gas. It's probably like a mile long. Thankfully, I don't have to deal with that issue because I don't have to travel far. I'm super grateful. For the people who do have to travel, it's so scary. Hey guys, I just got home from my third day in in-person learning. I definitely am starting to get used to it. It took me a solid two days to get used to everything and I'm finally getting the hang of it now. So I have a dentist appointment and if you know me, I'm not really a huge fan of the dentist. Hey guys, I picked up these mini brownies at Trader Joe's and let me just tell you, they are so good. This one's like a perfect square. Yeah, this so. parking lot, especially at night, looks super sketch. You would not want to be here by yourself at night. And my mom's over there. Oh wow, you can't see that. It's just, yeah. There's my mom over there. She's walking. It's just not a good look if you are alone. This is your friendly reminder not to be in secluded places by yourself. dinner yet i'm cooking some dinner right now it's in the microwave i don't have time to like actually cook cook so i'm just microwaving it i just packed my lunch for tomorrow these look really good at trader joe's so i try i'm trying these tomorrow they're like kind of like almond joys but just um no coconut i have some applesauce and then this like crackers and then cheese with i think it's with ham so it's cheese and ham and crackers it is 11 o'clock i'm so freaking tired and i'm going to sleep so see you at seven o'clock good morning guys it is what time is it 7 30 i got up a little earlier just to straighten my hair now i'm going to get on my outfit show you guys that and then i'm gonna do my makeup then i'm gonna pack my bag i don't know if i mentioned this yesterday but i think i'm getting picked up early from school because i have nothing 
for eighth period. It's a pretty nice looking day. Tomorrow I am running a yard sale. I'm super excited. I am selling my big rug that I took out of my room a few days ago. And then I'm also selling like a few of my clothes just because I need to get rid of stuff. I'm going to get ready. I'll see you in a sec. It is 2.30. My mom picked me up from school early. I had nothing to do eighth period. It was kind of just like, it wasn't like a free period, but it was at the same time. You could have been doing work. I was, just because I have a lot to do over the weekend. It's supposed to be nice tomorrow. So I wanted to get a head start on my homework tonight so I can just like kind of relax outside tomorrow. Here's my outfit, nothing really special. I have this like North Carolina. UNC shirt, I guess, with my light blue Lululemon Fast and Free leggings. Like I said, I'm obsessed. And then I'm wearing just these Air Maxes that are like gray, teal, and pink. I brought this Patagonia sweatshirt. Gonna finish my lunch because I didn't get to finish it this during my lunch break. Exciting news for the summer. Now that I have my like first dose of my vaccine shot, I'm supposed to be getting you know, this is a great angle. I'm supposed to be getting my second shot. Um very soon. When I'm fully vaccinated, it'll be before summer, which is great. And I am hoping, so we're already going to New York and I'm hoping we can go to Niagara Falls. I've been there twice already, but I love it there. And then we're also definitely going to Arizona. Me and my dad are. This trip has been canceled twice already. Hopefully we do not run into any problems. <laughs> this is still in the works. Like we have not booked a thing, but we were just talking about it. And you're gonna think I'm freaking crazy here. Never been to Universal or Disney. We are working something out. <laughs> Hopefully we can go this year. I have always wanted to see the Star Wars land. I think it's like Galaxy's Edge or something. And then I've also really wanted to see the Harry Potter Hogwarts. I am a sucker for like the science-y fiction-y stuff. We live on the east side, east coast, so like Florida's not really like far far, but it's like a 14 hour, 15 hour drive and we're not about to drive that. So I'm planning to do that in July and then going to Arizona in July. So it's gonna be crazy if we do. Even with Arizona, it's crazy. Last year, I did not do pretty much, I didn't really do any traveling, but this year I'm doing so much and I'm glad. It's honestly like I missed out on traveling last year. ready to go to bed soon but I have to take a shower I will talk to you guys in a sec y'all it has literally been the most hectic week ever anyways um again forgot to take my makeup off so I look like a raccoon I spent a solid three or four hours setting up for this yard sale that we're having in the community I'm still so obsessed with my carpet it's so soft now I'm going to fix this Good morning guys, it is 11.38 and just finished the yard sale. It went from 8 to 11 basically. I'm just chilling here. I like starting the morning off early, but I got up really early. Just cooked some delicious pasta. And now I have zero clue what to do. Well, I could do homework, but I don't feel like doing that right now. I think I'm just gonna like take a little nap. If I have the option not to get up at seven o'clock, then I'm going to sleep in. Even though there's a gas shortage and we're kind of running empty on gas, I need to go to the store to pick up a few grocery items. And then I'm also going to look for a new watch band. I think we're at the shopping center that we're gonna go to has gas. So I'm gonna try to look for any gas just to see if there's any because currently we're like almost empty, but like not there yet, but we don't wanna run out if we get stuck in traffic. That's what we're doing. I'm wearing this like Carolina basketball shirt and then these Under Armour um, shorts. It's really hot outside. And then I'm wearing some white sneakers that I haven't put on yet. I don't remember the last time I vlogged, but I think it was before we left to go run errands. Now I'm back, obviously, it's like 9.45 and I just got out of the shower. It was super relaxing. I think I'm gonna go to bed soon, edit this video tomorrow, get it up tomorrow, and 
yeah my plans for tomorrow are kind of basic i have to what do i have to do okay i have to book a rental car for arizona i have to book just like a florida trip and then i also have to i take my driving test driver's test driving driver's license test whatever you call it this thursday and like the nerves haven't really started to kick in but i feel like once we get closer to the date then yeah they'll start kicking in but i kind of want to do a practice test and like work on some more basic skills just so i don't forget them just because you know i don't want to look like a fool on my test but since gas prices are super expensive in virginia like they're literally higher than california because if you don't know I don't know who, but like, I think somebody hacked one of the like pipelines. I don't know, but something to do with the gas and gas is super hard to find right now. And it's super expensive if you do find any. And hopefully the situation gets fixed by Thursday so I can take my test. Today we actually found gas, which was really cool. The whole toilet paper thing is now with gas. If you live like in the south southeast kind of or like on the east coast in general like gas is like the new toilet paper back when COVID, like everybody's scrambling to find gas so we found some thank gosh because my mom's car was like literally on empty and then yeah my car that was like the highlight of my day just finding gas i'm gonna go to sleep and like edit this video and i'll see you guys in the next video